Hey everybody, this is Sean Powell. Um, we'll make sure that my audio is working. Sometimes every once in a great while, Windows 10 doesn't work for it for some reason. I apologize. All right, y'all. Uh, this is obviously Traffic Hurricane, right? Um, and of course, that's what I'm promoting right now. That's what I love. Power Elite System is always going to be my backbone system. Um, but I want to talk about something, y'all. A guy contacted me yesterday, and uh, the, the thing that really got me about him was um, he wasn't well, he would love to join me, but he couldn't in Power Lead Systems because his country is not one of the countries available to Power Lead Systems. I don't know if y'all know this or not, y'all, but a lot of countries like Nigeria, uh, particular, I get a bunch of people from Nigeria, sharp people, that would love to use Power Lead Systems. They go to sign up, the country's not available. And there's other parts of the world the exact same way. Pay sources become an issue for a lot of these different countries. Uh, and they're not going to be allowed into it. So somewhere like Power Lead Systems may be limited to that. Now, of course, Power Lead Systems does everything it can to you know become available. But y'all, I'm gonna tell you what, Paylution is absolutely incredible. It is rock solid, like clockwork, every Wednesday for payday inside of Power Lead Systems and in my bank the next day. So I absolutely love what they do. But somewhere like even um, PayPal, y'all, as big as PayPal is. There's parts of Africa that PayPal is not allowed into. There's other parts of the world. So it becomes an issue when you can't pay for a product. You see what I'm saying? So the product really can't go there um, in, in that sense. So it's just a shame. But you know, what really got me yesterday was he already knew that. This guy here contacted me because, to be honest, he'd been doing research on trying to overcome the issue. Okay? Now, I grant you, I love using Power Lead Systems. I love everything it does for me. But I'm a fighter in the sense that if this was gone, if if my funnels and everything I make, every you know, every all all the funnel stuff I make, landing pages, you know, whatever I've got built, you know, to help my businesses, if they were gone, I'd be just like him. I would go find my solution. I'd start making my own landing pages, my own sales pages. I would do whatever I had to do. And I sensed that with him because he's already been doing his homework when he realized that, you know, nothing he did was going to get him power lead systems. <laughs> Sorry, it's just not going to happen. And, you know, I started thinking yesterday evening um, and I posted about him into Action Taker Success Group. And, you know, just to, to let people know that you have to find a solution, whatever your roadblock is, what you going to do? You're going to quit doing, you know. He, he might have been inside of our Action Taker Success Group, and he sees us talking about how great Power Lead Systems is, or he sees us talking about how great, uh, you know, uh, Traffic Hurricane is such a lot, as you know, and he wanted to use our pages or something and, and not be able to. You know, I know that would really suck to be at that, you know, at that point, but you would have to figure out your own solution, y'all. That's, that's what roadblocks are. It's you figuring out how to make it happen. You understand what I'm saying? So I made something after I made that post yesterday, because I'm going to tell you what, y'all, even though I've got a really high ratio of active members to the amount of people I've sponsored, I've got 79, actually got 80, another one of my ladies has uh, sent bank wires, and it's going to be in a couple of days. So I've got 80 active members out of 215 I've sponsored. I think 215 is where I'm at right now, if I'm not mistaken. So that is a hell of a ratio. It's a great ratio. But I've got at least, at least another 20 people who are letting their roadblock or whatever their sob story is or whatever it is to keep them from moving ahead. And I look at someone like this guy here and I say, you know, I would take a fighter like him any day, any day over having someone who's got the ability to do so and not taking the time to fix their issue so they can get going. To be honest, I don't think they're really serious about their business. Uh, there's no petty roadblock of any sort that will keep me from building a business that I want to do and getting out the people and, and changing. When I when I sign up to a business that I believe in, y'all, I already know I'm going to blow the damn doors off. That's a given. I think like that, right? I know I'm going to put the work in and I believe in it and people are going to sense that with me and they're going to relate to me. That's how it works. Okay. Let me show you what I made, y'all. Uh, I actually thought I said, you know, something that's solving issues and stuff. Rubik's Cube as a kid, you know, I'm, I'm, I was uh, born in the 70s, but I was an 80s kid. You know, I loved the 80s big time. And that was a big part of my childhood, y'all. You know, I've, of course, I've got one. Just 
you see them in stores now and stuff like that, you know, but that was a big thing for me. You know, so I keep one in the living room just so I can see it at all times. Uh, it kind of reminds me of my childhood. No, I will play with it at times. Um, but, you know, this is a prime example. And I think of this guy here that I talked to yesterday, and I'm so glad he reached out to me. You know, there's not a whole lot I could have done for him, but if there's anything I could do for him to, you know, if he needed my videos or anything to help him, yes, I would let him use it in a heartbeat because I would do anything I could to help him that is going to overcome his issues and make things happen. That's what I'm proud of, y'all. I'm more proud of him than someone that signed up on day one, bought 100 ad packs. To be honest, this guy here is showing who he is. You know what I'm saying? This, this is the character he is. This is the belief he's got. This is his fight in him, and it's obvious. He's having a fight from day one, okay? Do I see this as cheating? Nope. It's taking advantage and not being denied. That's how I look at this. And, y'all, I did a video yesterday for Power Lead Systems. And it was a hell of a video. I'm going to go ahead and tell you, it was like, oh, man, it was, it was the second longest video I have ever created. One hour and two minute video. And it's, it, I, I tell you, I don't think there's a more powerful Power Lead Systems video anywhere out there. And I, I went back and watched it myself. And I'm not bragging. I'm just saying I haven't seen anybody that laid out exactly what he did, the, 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 the uh, strategies that I used. And it wasn't like I went into Power Lead Systems and say, okay, I'm going to sign up here, and today I'm going to use this strategy. Of course not, y'all. You know what it is? It's applying action all the time and learning from it all the time on the way. Some of y'all think that, you know what, I'm going to sign up, I'm going to stand right here in this one spot, I'm going to let my sponsor tell me exactly everything I'm going to do, and then I'm going to get mad because my sponsor hasn't spent enough time with me. Well, has your sponsor got over 200 people or 1,000 people? Because usually you pick somebody that's a leader, right? That's what you're hoping. If I just get in this back pocket, I won't make it. I know, what the, I know what the mentality of this is, right? I know this. You know what you really need? Someone that believes in the business that's going to apply action. That's what you need as a sponsor. You need that more than you need a guru. to be. That's the honest truth, y'all. But that's, that's how you think. And I, I know I used to think the same way. But y'all, what, what you really need to do is... Quit thinking you need a Ph.D. in business or someone that's going to hold your hand the entire time and focus, y'all. I can, I can tell you the answer to everything right here. I don't care what the damn business is. Go ahead listen to this. Listen. Pick one way of getting out the people. Pick one way. Okay? Whichever way works best for you. I don't care which one it is. It don't matter which one it is as much as you pick it and say, I'm going to master this way. I'm going to master it. I don't give a damn about anything else. I'm going to master this one way of getting out the people. And then you don't quit. You don't quit. Is there going to be a roadblock? Of course. Of course, y'all. If not, everybody be taking that same path to get rich. So, you know, there's going to be some kind of negativity along that path. If you do paid advertising, guess what? It's paid advertising. You're going to have to, you're going to have to be dishing out some money, y'all. You're going to have to learn a lot quickly. You better learn how to master email marketing, too. That goes with the territory. You know that, right? Okay. If it's Facebook, well, you got limitations of Facebook. And guess what? Facebook ain't fair, y'all. Sometimes Facebook will, will swipe down people for no reason that somebody else is doing a lot worse than they were, yet here they are in Facebook jail. you got to learn to come up with your own solutions to whatever path you're taking. Whatever it is, sometimes thinking out of the box is going to give you that answer, y'all. And let me tell you something, y'all. YouTube is uh, about standing out so that you can get seen. In the world of Facebook, you're already getting seen, but you got to learn to stand out. Because you like a bad advertisement on TV. Of course they're going to see you, but it doesn't mean it's, it's going to mean anything. See what I'm saying? So you got to learn. And whatever way you're applying action, it's going to tell you what you need to do. If you are smart enough, y'all, to have a business, smart enough to figure it out, put the work in, apply action, and don't quit. Don't quit. Don't just say I'm not going to quit. I mean, literally, no, you know that I'm not going to quit. You know you're not going to quit. There's a difference between just saying I'm not going to quit and knowing I'm not going to quit. I won't go ahead and tell you that there is a difference. It's, it's hard-headedness. It's a firmness. You know what I'm saying? It's something that's saying I've made a decision. It's rock solid. It's going to change my life. And this path I'm taking is going to get me there. And whatever roadblock that God puts out in front of me, roadblocks are good, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and tell you. Do you know why? Because everybody in Facebook, y'all, hit that same roadblock. I knew when I hit it. 
because nobody went beyond it. What did I do? I hit my damn head on that roadblock for the longest time. And here's a little easy exit right here, y'all. Let me tell you how this exit is. It's beautiful. I mean, we're talking like our early spring day. You can see the uh, uh, pear trees sitting right here. Birds chirping. It, 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 I mean, it looks like something from, from Snow White or something, right? Oh, that's just an easy cruise over here. That looks so comfortable. Probably takes you down to a lake somewhere. That's what quitting looks like when you're hitting your head on the roadblock, right? God's going to leave you, say, all right, I'm going to go have supper. I'm going to go have lunch. I'm going to take a little time. I might sit around and, and, and you know, take my time. And I'm going to come back and see, are you still hitting your head on that roadblock? That's what God's going to do. And when he comes back and he sees you still hitting your head, you didn't take that easy exit. That's when he's going to give you the answer. Bam, I'm proud of you, son. Here you go. Bam. We're going to go to the next level. And guess what? There may be another roadblock. But you're that much closer and you got further than anybody else I know of in the Facebook world because you went beyond it. You would not let yourself be denied. That's how I think. I always thought that way. Do you know why I thought that way? Because I had a burn in my stomach in belief that I will make a change in what I'm doing and my business is going to get there. My first business, y'all, was crap. It was crap. I didn't know it. You know what I saw it as? How I saw it was amazing. It got my brain turning. It made me realize that I was stuck and where I worked at, and I was not aware of that. So thank God I was seeing what I saw. Do I have learned a lot since then? Yes. But you know what I learned? Sincerity. Me opening the mouth about a business that really wasn't even that good, I blistered that business. I got 8,000 leads, 8,000 people on my list in six months, and I didn't know what I was doing. That's what belief does. That's what applying action is. That's what getting comfortable applying action, figuring out a game plan while you're going. That's why my PLS video yesterday was so good, to be honest. Because you're hearing somebody sitting there telling you what I learned from right here at the beginning and applying action all the time. Hell, I was getting incredible results and didn't even know I was. I thought that's what everybody should be getting. That's how I was thinking right. Why? Because I didn't sit here hoping that my sponsor would hold my hand so later on I can bitch and complain and say it was their fault I failed. Because that's what a lot of y'all do. Or worse, you can't even get going yet. You, you ain't going to be like that guy yesterday. You know what? My bank doesn't like PESA. I guess I'm not going to do it. Really? Is that what you're going to do? Is that? I mean, seriously, is that? I'm not saying this. Uh, I'm just giving you an example. You know what I'm saying? When I started online business, y'all, it took me two weeks, two weeks to get started in that. Thank God my vision on this was big enough and my belief was big enough and the burn in my stomach that God gave me. Because I will tell you what, y'all, I couldn't think nothing else. I would come home after working all day long. I mean, I'm not, y'all know how many hours I used to work in restaurants. If you've ever been in a restaurant, 65 hours a week in a restaurant on I 40. In the spring, summertime, y'all, is ridiculous. It gets so packed. This is the God's honest truth. The front door won't shut because people are trying to get in. It's not even that big of a place. We also, because of I-40, how the stoplight is, listen to this. They, the town has to pay for sheriffs to go there. They don't use the light, and they direct traffic because people trying to come into our parking lots would back up the cars up 40, and they were scared it was going to get to the major part, not just up the exit. That's how busy this place is. When I eat, I wouldn't sit down because if I did, I didn't want to get back up. That's how busy this place was. And I would come home. Sometimes, I'm not even going to lie to y'all. I wanted to get in my business that when it sucked, yet I had napkins in my pocket where I've been thinking about it, about ideas I didn't want to lose, written down on my napkins in my pocket, and sit down and start doing my business. That's what I did. And guess what? Sometimes I didn't even wash for the first couple of hours, sitting there stinking, slobbering on the keyboards where I was falling asleep. You are going to sacrifice in some way, form, or fashion to make it on online business. That's a fact, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and tell you. There's going to be some kind of sacrifice. It's going to take belief. It's going to take commitment. It's going to take some sort of sacrifice. And it's going to mean you knowing I'm not going to quit. It's going to take all that. I would get one hour sleep. 
And then I would get up the next morning and be bouncing off the walls with excitement at my next day of work because I see the people coming in or I see commissions coming in. I deserved what I got, y'all. I put the work in. That work is the most valuable thing you ever, ever are going to learn. It, it's not theory. It's learning to make it work for you your way. It's learning to make it work for you your way because you tried everything. And guess what, y'all? If you're screwing up, great. Because screwing up is going to teach you, well, I don't need to point this way. I need to point this way. That's one of the most valuable things you can learn is screwing up. No, and I'm not going to quit. Focus on one way of getting out to the people. If I'm not getting leads, guess what? Try something else. If I'm getting some leads, then try something else. If it goes down, guess what? I'll point back in the right direction. That's how I think. Anyhow, y'all, I'm proud of that guy yesterday for call, uh, contacting me, not telling me about his problem. Cause I was, To be honest, I was about to write him off just like everybody else. I can't do nothing for him. I'm sorry. I, I can't. I, his country is not available. What am I supposed to do? That's not what he wanted. He wanted to let me know that he was trying to come up with a solution. Did I have any solutions that might help him? Because his homework, what he's been doing right now to figure it out, is what he's got here. And you know what? I was proud of him, man. I was proud of seeing somebody come up with his own solution. When I got 20 deadbeats that, I, it's like I said, should have been built. You could have built your damn business in amount of time. And, that's, and they keep playing with me, just calling. And say, you know what? After, I'm going to tell you the honest truth. After a week of two of, of sob stories and, and things of that nature, whatever you're telling me goes to blah, 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 blah. And it's before long I won't even answer the phone anymore because I know you're wasting my time. There's somebody more valuable. Even someone who's not on my downline, like him, is more valuable to me than someone who is my downline Who's, who can't put their, they just aren't even going to try to put it together. So my opinion, y'all, do whatever you got to do to come up with a solution. And it's like I said, think out of the box, apply action, get over your roadblocks, do whatever it takes, and don't ever quit. When you feel that way, y'all, you grit your teeth when you're just focused, you're going to find the way. It's going to change your life. And the first time, maybe a little longer, it takes tough. It took me six months to get free from a job my very first time, right? But guess what? I'm very confident about what I do. I know how to focus to people. I know how to promote, you know, promote the hell out of anything that I believe in. I can do it now and get free from a job in a month or two months flat. I'm confident I can do that. You got to put the work in and learn how to make it work for you your way. All right, y'all. If you're not in traffic hurricane, you should be. <laughs> I'm getting paid to promote my own business. Uh, I think uh, yeah, that's just a given. The business doubles every month and a half, two months. Power lead systems, I'm getting paid to use my own tools. I've got enough videos showing proof of the income. I'm not, I'm not going to do all that, y'all. But you need to go ahead at minimum, sign up at Traffic Hurricane. It's free to do. Go ahead and frame me on Facebook. I'll personally welcome you to my Facebook group. This is for my Facebook group. This is what I do stuff for. And my Facebook group is called Action Taker Success Group. I call it Action Takers for a reason. Okay? So sign up, y'all, at minimum. Get in touch with me. Be tickled to help you out. Appreciate it.